Now, there's been a rampant increase in cases of snake bites envenoming in India, especially in rural parts of Maharashtra. It is one of the most neglected tropical diseases. In a rare incident, a six-year-old girl is battling for her life after getting a snake bite. In our next report, we tell you about this crisis and how a doctor couple is on a mission to save victims. Watch this special report by our principal correspondent, Disha Shah. This is six-year-old Tejasvi Gaude from a small village in Pune, a district in India's western state of Maharashtra. She's battling for her life as a common crait. A highly venomous snake bit her a few days ago at her home while she was asleep. Her relatives first took her to a private hospital where she was treated for five days. But she could not get the proper treatment. The family then rushed her to a nursing clinic in Pune's Narayan Gao town approximately 190 kilometers from India's financial capital, Mumbai. Since 1992, the medical facility is run by a doctor couple, Dr. Sadanan and Dr. Pallavi Raut. They are believed to have saved many snake bite victims. Till fifth day of uh, after bite, there was no recovery. And doctors thought that it was a branded case. Say so they advised parents to take the girl to the home. But anyhow, they came to know about our hospital and they called me and they brought uh, the girl to our hospital in a cardiac ambulance on a ventilator. So since admission, we are treating her, we are giving her respiratory support with the ventilators, antibiotics and other uh, medications, parental nutrition and uh, we are taking her uh, care, neurological care, everything. Tejasvi's case is not alone. Earlier this week, India was shocked by developments in a state hospital in Nandit city where 31 people died, several of them were victims of snake bites. Now this couple is trying to save as many people as they can by giving them early and timely treatment at their hospital. At the medical centre visited by Vion, one can see people from all age groups getting treatment for snake bites. From a 65-year-old senior citizen to a 17-year-old boy who was bitten by a snake and brought to the hospital within the next two hours. The couple sometimes works tirelessly all day and tries to respond to every distressed snake bite call that comes to them. In 1990, the couple had come to Narayangao to set up a heart and diabetes hospital, but got anxious after coming across the death of a girl by a snake bite. It was after that experience that the couple decided to work towards the issue of snake bite. We have achieved this very slowly. Initially, patients are very minimum. We have treated them with our knowledge and experience. And we have upgraded our knowledge also. We have both of us, my wife, Dr. Pallavi, and myself, have attended uh, international toxinology course at Australia. And we are the only couple in India who have completed this course. And we have tried to upgrade our knowledge with various conferences, international conferences. But the doctor couple believes that awareness is the key here. They believe even today a lot of people still do not take snake bites seriously. Instances of snake bites in Maharashtra are high and they are reported to have the fifth largest number of deaths among the states. The couple has saved more than 6,000 lives of snake bite victims as part of their Mission Zero snake bite death project. To create a larger awareness on the ground level, the couple has also started visiting more than 100 tribal residential schools in and around Pune and even across Maharashtra to create awareness about the snake bites and the precautions that needs to be taken. We think that Awareness is the most important pillar in our zero snake bite death mission. In order to, uh, in order to reduce the snake bite deaths, we realized the awareness program's uh, uh, importance and we started the awareness programs so that people could uh, do not waste their golden hour and do not uh, go to the mantriks and temples and uh, unnecessary waste their golden hour, first golden hours. A recent national mortality survey has said that India saw 1.2 million snake bite deaths from 2000 to 2019. 
According to WHO, snake bite envenoming is one of the most neglected tropical diseases, leading to around 82,000 to 140,000 annual deaths globally. It also says that it affects around 400,000 people every year, causing permanent physical or psychological disabilities, including kidney failure, blindness, paralysis, amputation, and post traumatic stress disorder. With video journalist Sidesh, this is Disha Shah's report for Vion World is One. Vion is now available in your country. Download the app now, get all the news on the move.